Alright, so yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I am back with another video, and in this video, I have a updated version of this video, which I did here in 2019. Everything still seems to be, like, if not the same, it still seems to be working, but I just wanted to do an update, and yeah, let's get right into it. Alright. So, as always, you want to, uh, we are going to be doing a no-coding tutorial on how to animate. Uh, why did I say as always? But yeah, we're going to be doing that. So, insert your character in or get a mesh, whatever you want. Uh, if you want to insert your character, just hit play. At the test tab, hit pause, copy your character, blah, blah, blah. Alright, so, now that you have whatever you want in, you're going to want to come on over to the plugin tab up at the top here. When you are up here, you will see all the plugins you have. So, you will want to either choose the rig builder if you're going to build your uh, rig. Here we go. Yeah, if you want to make the animation on this and then export it to your character, you can do that. Or you could just grab your character. So, in this one, I'm just going to use my character. I don't know why he looks like this. Okay, so now uh, you're going to want to open up the animation editor. As you can see, they have the animation editor like built into the thing here. All you have to do is just pull this off because you're going to want to hide it. And then you can scale it like that. So if you're having problems with that, all you need to do is just pull it off. So first things first, we are going to want to... Here, let me just move this over here. Actually, I'll keep it in the bottom for now and then pull it off after. All right. So click on your character and you're going to want to name your animation. I'll just name it Hi. And you will see the animation thing open up. So now, obviously, you will have your, like, keyframes and whatever, and you can set the amount of time you want. So I believe this is four seconds out of one minute. Yeah. So one minute's definitely enough for us, so... Okay. Can you, can you come back, please? Thank you. All right. So now you are going to want to do the animation, obviously, so I'll make it look like... I'll just speed this part up here. Why not? Alright guys, so I'm going to show you what I have here. He, okay, okay. I should probably, oops. I should probably spread this out a bit more like that. I'll spread it out even a bit more. And here we go, from the beginning. There you go. So you see here, he lifts up his arm and does a little wave with his hand. I know it's clipping. You'd probably want to make it not clip. But yeah, there you basically have your editor and uh, your <laughs> edit, not editor. And all right. Yeah. So now that you have your edit, if you uh, also I forgot to mention, if you want to make it move, you do have to you have to hit R. To change it from rotate to move so make sure you do that and then yeah you could make it look like like his knee just fell off like like this Whew. okay but yeah so now that you have your edit you want to take this up and if you have a second monitor that's perfect if not that's also perfect what you're going to want to do is just hide this up in the corner up here and then you will get your recording software ready. I am using OBS for mine, so let's go. Alright, so start recording, obviously, and then get it to the start. 
and then if you're going to talk or be quiet, whatever you're going to want to do, just hit play. There you go, your edit played, and now you have this footage. So you can either choose to save or to just delete it, whatever you want. I'm not going to save this one because it's not that good. But yeah, so as you now you can close out of Roblox Studio. Alright, so guys, now you are in your editor, whatever one you're using. So, you're going to want to, I'm pretty sure most editors should have this. If you play it, you can see here you have like this, uh, all the Roblox stuff around it. What you're going to want to do is just edit it so that it basically just crops out the stuff also you're probably gonna want to have a floor or something that way it gets rid of the grid pieces but yeah now you can see here I centered it the best I can because I'm bad at centering and there we go it played my thing so yeah guys that's all you need to know for the new updated version in 2020 hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you smash the like button and subscribe road to 700 and i'll see you in the next one bye